2024 is officially with us and we are around about halfway through the month of January and releases have been a bit slow but um i'm assuming they will pick up in the rest of the month right so this video is about new fragrance releases um if you also like to read up on the latest fragrance releases ifragranceofficial.com is my uh, go-to uh, uh, website as well as perfumo.com uh, so here goes um the first one on the list um another alexa so carolina herrera's bad boy cobalt has an alexa so yeah um it's an edp uh top notes of sage black pepper and then the mid you've got black truffle resinous woods and then vanilla and olibanum to round things off at the base so yeah sounds very interesting this um uh, bad boy ranges it's an intriguing one you know the first one most of them are fairly good but cobalt sort of you know kick things up a little bit higher uh, in terms of quality and just the scent you know um i really really like the uh, cobalt and yeah hopefully the elixir is gonna just uh knock it out of the park and close things off now um yeah so what they say about this new release the brand wanted to take a line uh, the brand wanted to take the line a step further by offering the audience a stronger and richer iteration of last year's release so they decided to release another flanker like bad boy cobalt elixir the edp for men which is an aromatic ambery and woody blend that befits a modern man's sensibilities right the concept behind the bad boy uh, cobalt elixir is to celebrate individuality and the freedom to choose your own path it is a new bold masculine multifaceted scent that addresses the difference the different shades of a modern man's character like confidence and strength as well as sensitivity and nonchalance right so yeah bad boy cobalt elixir the latest release uh, from carolina Herrera. um the next one here is from the house of uh jpg jean paul gautier one of my favorite absolute favorite houses um when it comes to male fragrances yeah so from the um lebo line you've got paradise gardens you've got uh, you had the lebo and then you had the the lebo the parfum now you've got paradise uh, garden so this is the, that scent from jean paul gautier based around the note of coconut so very, very nice um uh, fragrance uh overall the edt the edp the perfume very nice so this one definitely is going to be in that ballpark this one a bit of more green facets i see you've got green feet you've got mint sandal tonka bean as well as the coconut and the ginger in the notes here so they say inspired by the 2020 2010 and 2011 autumn winter uh show uh, this luxuriant garden is a paradise for the all-consuming pleasures and passions of Le Beau Paradise Garden and La Belle Paradise. So La Belle is the female version, right? Um, emerald green glass em em embroidered with a flamboyant vine leaf featuring colorful couture details. Uh, who could resist a naked bottle? Let yourself be act, uh, captivated. So yeah, the classic torso, and then there's always an, a different element to sort of, you know, I think there's a leaf, uh, embroidered leaf sitting there by the, where the private uh, parts would be, right? An unforgettable bottle, the tropical radiance of the couture embroidered vine leaf conceals the secret garden inhibited by this naked emerald green bottle. Mm. Okay, an unbeatable force of attraction plunges, plunges you into this hypnotic, sensual, masculine fragrance that is an elusive, that, that is as elusive as it is irresistible. So yeah, definitely another great release there um, from uh, uh, Jean-Paul Gautier. Definitely looking forward to sampling it, hopefully getting a bottle uh, for myself there. So yeah, it's a more green label um, uh, from Jean-Paul Gautier, right? Um, at number three from the house Killian, uh, born to be unforgettable. So a niche house Killian, um, lots and lots of great scents. One of my favorite angels share, like I always mention on the channel, you should know. Um, so um, born to be unforgettable, have top notes of lime cola. Um, so yeah, they're going for that fizzy 
a soda type of uh, scent here and then the mint you've got cinnamon nutmeg vanilla um and then you've got cedar wood in the in the base so i can just the notes of lime cola and then cinnamon nutmeg vanilla just gives me vanilla coke vibes you know that's just something that comes to mind but probably it smells very different to them so what they say about it they're a creation concocted by the all-known alberto marias right so anything from alberto marias a classic fragrance in these so it's definitely something go out and get it or sample it and yeah just go in on this one you know alberto marias never disappoints right and um, the new fragrance is said uh, to be wild and definitely unforgettable featuring notes that mimic the bubbly signature fizz of a cola drink like i said coca-cola cola it's a fizzy cola right um it opens with a blast of lime that awakens the senses followed by a cola a cola that is comprised of the fusion of cinnamon nutmeg and a dash of vanilla to fully embody the sweet and fizzy pop right yeah it's just as i thought it's got a pop fizzy vibe to it right so yeah and the last one on this list from terre de hermes hermes h24 hermes vibes right so this one is another one of those green type of fragrances right um so top notes herbal notes they just say herbal notes the mid you've got pear granita and then the base you've got a, a registered uh molecule called physal right or fiscal fiscal right yeah so i never heard of that first time so what they say about this new release after the success of the h24 edt and edp Hermes wanted to strike uh, while the iron is still hot uh, which is a great thing to do before we get about we forget about your fragrances release 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 right um the beautifully talented christian Nacho um returns once again to continue her fragrance saga with this release she wanted to capture the subtle beauty of urban uh nature right after a rain shower so yeah very green yeah urban, urban nature right after a green shower yeah i guess the smell of trees and fresh leaves and grass and all of that right the smell of wet pavements combined with the image of plants bursting out of concrete has been uh poeticized and romanticized, romanticized by a lot of people and it's about time someone captures the sensation in a scent form very interesting to capture the the scent of um the aftermath of rain in an urban environment you know the smell of uh wet pavement and the image of plants bursting out of concrete interesting interesting yeah so that's the four releases so far um part one of new fragrances for january 2024 carolina harris bad boy cobalt elixir edp um jean paul gautier's uh, la beau paradise garden and then by killian uh, born to be a for unforgettable and then terre de hermes uh hermes 24 hermes vibes vibes right yeah so with that said like subscribe till next time peace